and welcome back to City Skylines. Oh man, holy shit. So uh, I was just having a little like play around and uh, it turns out some of the tools, so I, I changed computer to a better computer. And some of the tools that I was using before didn't really work properly on that other, other machine. Whereas now, they do. And I kind of just decided to throw a whole load of trees down in West Shady Side. And look at it go. It is really, really kind of kind of come together now. I also put like a wood in, because you know what? Why not? Why not? Like a little bit of woods. Really kind of like, man, holy shit, that area looks a lot more, a lot more kind of like realistic now. And uh, yeah, just like fixed a few other like little problems that were going on. This roundabout is a mess. I kind of like tweaked a few little bits, but that's okay. And thank you to the 5,000 people that pointed out that this road wasn't working. Turns out there's like a little bit broken in here, a little bit broken by there, but it's all okay now. We're, we're totally sub, totally fine. So we're here and we're, we're building some stuff. And it seems like we've come out of the mega death slump. So no more kind of uh, that, that wave of mega death that was going on. Instead, it all seems to be working okay, and we're actually gaining a lot of people, and there's motherfucking demand for stuff. So much stuff. Still haven't quite gotten to the bottom of this, uh, this issue yet, the, uh, the, the, the demand for stuff. But seeing as everyone wants industry, I reckon, I reckon we're gonna be okay. So maybe garbage cat point needs a bit more a bit more fun and I think this whole kind of area it all looks a little bit kind of shitty so this can all be for the garbage cats so let's just do it let's just throw some roads in and kind of think kind of think just just some big actually wait, wait, let's let's kind of keep this let's keep this kind of gritty I kind of like my industrial being a a bit of a grid. It, it, it never feels too... too unrealistic. Great. And then we'll just throw out some, like, super roads. Boom. Super road. Super road. <laughs> Here we go. So yeah, I think like with uh, all the people that have been dying, all the areas that have been like added to this place, there's a there's a whole load more ca cats, cats, cats getting thrown out into the garbage, and so we need more places to kind of like process process the cats, and we're just gonna just gonna go for it. I don't mind if that bit's a bit wonky. That's fine. Here we go. So I've been kind of thinking about some of the other areas that we're going to we're going to add to, and I've got I've got some ideas now. I think some pretty some pretty cool ones too. Uh, and you know maybe maybe they'll be the tech island, beautiful, magical, mysterious tech island. I know there's a lot of hot demand for the super tech thing, but I've got to say I'm a little bit worried about Tech Island these days, as I'm worried it's going to be a bit of a bit like Duke Nukem Forever. Do you remember Duke Nukem Forever? That game was absolute trash, and people were waiting for it for so long. It was so hyped, and I think Tech Island is actually people are too excited for it, and it's never going to live up to your lofty expectations, it's only going to be a big disappointment. But, who knows, maybe it'll be a thing. One day. Maybe when we hit uh, 100,000 people, Tech Island can exist. We'll see. Okay, perfect. So, we've got some roads in here. That's great. That'll all be fine. We need water pretty quickly, actually. We just like throw some more things in up here. I completely forgot about this area. I think we can. I think we can do that. Let's just plop a few in. I know it's not super efficient. Shit, that's not even a thing. 
yeah, I know that this is not the efficient way to do do stuff, but we have a giant a giant poo leakage ever since we added in a few more of the older uh, the old shit pipes into Poo Lagoon, and it is f fucking breaching breaching its contamination barriers. It uh yeah, I'm a bit reluctant to pull too much water out of like any other area. Not so good. I wonder if we could. Oh, I don't. I don't want to risk kind of putting pumps in again. Because do you remember when we were just pulling shit water out of everywhere? That was the worst. I wonder. Maybe we can get away with just like one water pump up here. We'll see. But we can get a few more. There we go. Is that connected? No, it's not. Now it is. Huzzah. And sewage treatment is back on top. Incineration status is going down. We need some more incinerators. You know what? Garbage cap point. They can have two incinerators. Maybe they can even just have a traditional garbage dump as well. So they've already got one, but now they've got now they've got the second. Okay, so hopefully that will tick some of our industry demand, but we also have office demand. So I think we need to get some of the northwest shady side, this area, filled up with offices. Straight out here. And we can get rid of all of these like horrible power lines and, and work out exactly what's going on here. Because we started this area, threw down some stuff, started losing all of our money, and uh, then we had to go and build build some things to accommodate it. But if we slowly absorb out of here, I reckon I reckon we'll be okay. Hopefully there won't be too many like alien abductions or anything. I know the aliens are quite like prevalent in in this part of town, but. I don't think it will be the end of the world. Do you want like a... Do you want like a, a tunnel? Can we do that? I wonder. Sure. Okay. That is just a mess. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> it'll be okay. We'll, we'll we'll clog this whole area up with trees. It'll be nice, it'll be woody, it'll be it'll be beautiful. Uh what oh like, how are we gonna make this all work? It's like a road. A road up here. Is that Yeah. Oh, there's another bridge. You know what? I'm okay with that. I think we're kind of going to see how this all pans out. Can we get rid of him? Is that going to drop our water? It has dropped the water. Like, a little bit. But that's, that's fine. So, let's get some more guys. Do I like it? More looping? Like... Just some loops. Yeah, because we can get offices, there can be some connecty roads. Maybe this guy as well. Okay, that kind of... That kind of works. And then, let's get some nice tree... tree paths. Sure. I'm okay with there being some, like, little gaps. It's an aesthetic. Aesthetic. Not poor planning. That is not how I operate. I'm going for style there. And is a four-way junction? Is that too many junction? Too many junction. Uh, and then maybe 
Thing. And then you can go up there. You to there. And maybe we even like. Go through. Through like that. Okay, that's. It's a look. Certainly is a look. And we've got some space for like parks and parks and sheep. The, that's the name of my rap rap album, my city planners rap album, Parks and Shit. Available uh, in all good W. H. Smiths. Here we go. Bam. Right, water. So we want offices, and so we've got. Actually, we don't have any industrial demand. We do have power demand. Ah, oh, shit. Do we want to just, like, launch one of these in here? That should help. Eventually, I want to get, like, a nuclear power plant and uh, have, have that kind of powering the city rather than... We have, like, so many just, like, scattered, scattered power stations around the place. So, right, what are we doing? We are... Uh, this stuff. So, I guess by here, you can be. Let's just get rid of that guy. By here, we're gonna have some more residential because we have a little bit of residential demand. That looks all right. And maybe these two bits as well. And then it's. Offices. All the offices. Holy shit. Because if we get all these guys moving in, then maybe we can even drop the taxes down. Hopefully that will create more demand, because everyone's going to want to come and live in the beautiful city of... Um, yeah. That place. And, uh... Yeah, yeah, then we could just be charging. Charging less. Earning more. We're, we're just doing, like, so fine for cash now that we can start throwing down some more, like, super expensive things. Is that enough offices? Maybe, maybe they just aren't... Maybe, man, holy shit, the, like, the UFO just super caught me off guard for a second. Maybe we don't even need that many offices. Okay, we're gonna just drop the taxes just a little bit. You know what? 8%. These can go down to 10%. Uh, you can be eight. Regular industrial. Take them down to like six. Is that gonna kill, kill us? Okay, it hurts, hurts the income a bit, but you know, at this stage, I kind of just want the city to grow. Money, not too worried. Oh my god. Okay, right. Fuck growing the city. Oh my god. Shit. Okay, we're right. Grow the city. Grow it back. Okay, you, you come up one, one. Okay, right, we are too generous. Mayor, bankrupt city, oh my god. Oh my god, what happened? How oh, did we really like kind of lose that much? Okay, let's just like fast forward this. Bad. Oh. Oh, it's kind of kind of writing itself again. Maybe. Yeah, okay, perfect. Shit the bed. That was That was a little bit stressful. Whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the fuck? Did you see that? Oh,
the levitator flying to Springfield. Is that? <laughs> Is this actually a thing? Oh my god. Going to Springfield it's with, um, what are the aliens called in The Simpsons? Kang. Kang and K Kudos. K Krondos. Klongrong. <laughs> I don't know. It's Kang. Kang and something. I think, I think it's more fun at like high speed, isn't it? How far is it going to take us? Oh. Oh shit. He's coming back. He's new. He's just learnt to fly. And... They're all dead. They died. Into the sea with you. Okay, that was a... Uh, man, that was a good, a good kind of textbook Captain Distracto right there. Super Road. <laughs>